So I open it the long way like this, and then I just fold it and make sure the corners meet. And then I just, uh, I like to fold it in half the long way again. Keep it nice and straight and creased. So how long you been working here? About a year. Mm -hmm. Sometimes I feel like I have worked so hard for over 20 years and I still don't get the respect from anyone at Gold Star Boston. Father O'Malley would cringe if he heard me say this. <laughs> But I drank a full glass of wine tonight. I'm not holding back anything. You know? I deserve a little more respect than what I've been getting. It's a long time coming, and it's time they paid me some notice. I've earned it. I mean, I'm a real person. I have feelings, just like the rest of them. So why can't they treat me the way they all treat each other? Uh, are you OK? Yeah, I'm just tired. So, as I was saying, I believe this retreat is about me standing up for myself and being heard. You sure I can't get you a blanket? No. You look like you're about to fall asleep. No, I'm fine. Just resting my eyes. My life sucks, it always has. I clean every room with this electric broom. The bathroom sink, I give it a spray. That awful stink, I just flush it away. Those towels on the floor, they don't conserve anymore. If they were on the rack, I wouldn't strain my back. With each bed I make, with each step I take, my name I won't forsake. I'll make it someday, I'm going all the way. Work never scared me, only that they won't know my name. But I keep doing it the same, one bed at a time. My life sucks, wicked bad. But as long as they know me, I will never be. Sad.